It's the weekly reset for Destiny 2, so let's go over what is available for this week, and we're going to start right now. What's up guys, Reckless here and welcome to Guardian Watcher. If it's your first time here and you love Destiny and learning all things about the game, then subscribe and click on the bell icon, that way you don't miss out on anything. So, let's actually get started with the milestones. First off, we have Ikora's Challenge, which you need to complete 5 challenges from Ikora Ray. Then we have today's gift, which you need to complete a dawning gift and deliver it to the lucky recipient. Then we have the Nightfall. This week's Nightfall is the Pyramidian. And modifiers on that are Torrent, which boundless power erupts from within. Your abilities recharge much faster. And then we have Time Warp Zero Hour, which the mission timer cannot be extended. Choose your battles carefully. Next, we have the Leviathan, which you need to complete the Leviathan Raid or the Eater of Worlds Raid Lair. Then we have Call to Arms, which you need to win glory by participating in Crucible matches. Then we have Clan XP, which you earn Clan XP. Then Flashpoint this week is on Nessus which you need to complete public events on Nessus, and if you do the heroic versions of these, you can get them done quicker. Then we have Strike Up Peace, which you enter and complete matches in the Mayhem Crucible playlist. And last but not least, we do have the Heroic Strikes, which you need to complete three Heroic Strikes. So let's see what Tess Everest has this week at the Eververse. Starting off with the emotes, we have the Floss Dance. And that's pretty much it. As for your Sparrow, we have the Solaris Celestina. Ships, we have Saint 14's Grey Pigeon. For the ornaments, we have Break the Dawn for the Merciless. Turns your Merciless white. Looks pretty cool. And then we have the Silver Bullet for that wonderful Crimson. If you guys would like to see a review that I did on the Crimson yesterday, then I will put that in an annotation at the end of this video. For the armor, we have the Omega Mechanos Boots. This gives you one mobility and two recovery. For the ghost shell, we have symphonic shell. Shell perks on these are random. And then we have your wonderful green trans mat. For shaders, we have the Vanguard Magnus Gloss. as well as the Omelon Meteor Gloss. As for our wonderful medallions, we have the Fire Team Medallion, the Gleaming Boon of the Vanguard, as well as the Gleaming Boon of the Crucible. Don't forget to visit Cade 6 in order to get the wonderful treasure maps for this week. This week, Pizza. it is on Nessus. And you can buy all of these for 4,800 Glimmer each. I'm actually going to buy mine now. And if you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to watch these other two Destiny videos. You never know, you just might like them. And if you do, leave a like, share them, and then come back for more because you know you want to. Thank you guys for watching. And remember, less guns doesn't mean less crime. And I will see you guys next time.